Please mind the gap between the train and the platform. Please mind the gap between the train and the platform. Welcome back to my channel. This is Starbucks Starbucks, and I want to show you some of my Starbucks Korea cards. And these cards are special because they have corresponding envelopes. Starbucks Korea used to make envelope envelopes for each Starbucks card design. They are matchy matchy, but they stopped doing that. So I want to show you each card and its corresponding envelope. So first is this spring card from I think this is from 2013. You can see the design here. There are sakura, cherry blossoms, and the Korean national flower, Rose of Sharon, Mugunwa. And here is the envelope, corresponding envelope. Very matchy matchy, right? So pretty. And here. So each card I finish, I'll insert them back. I took them out of the envelope one by one so I can show them to you guys. Oops, okay. Next card is another spring card. So this is the Korean national flower, Mugunga, Rose of Sharon. And this is uh, 2014. And look at the envelope. So gorgeous. So matchy matchy. The flower here is the same flower on the card. So pretty. Right. So the first one, the first card I showed you was 2013. And this one is 2014. Okay. The next card is this one. Um, it looks like a cross stitch art, right? Like crisscross design. This is from year 2014, and this is the matching envelope with the cross stitch heart. Right? So cute. Yes, with Starbucks. Uh, I don't know why Starbucks Korea stopped giving these pretty envelopes. Maybe they just want to save money. Must must be. That's, that's the most accurate uh, guess for stopping the envelope. Saving costs. Yeah. So this is also an embroidered... Um, this looks like a cross stitch to you. Cross stitch embroidery. But this is a Valentine's Day card. Valentine's Day 2013. So gorgeous. Oh, with a heart. Okay, the envelope has a heart. So it must be, yeah. The previous one must also be Valentine's Day. And here, if you can see, the des there's also design hidden on the envelope. Like, if you put it against the light, you can see the hearts. So cool. Now, uh, Starbucks Korea gave plain black envelopes for when you buy Starbucks cards. They give you plain black envelope. No design, just plain black. So this one is Cherry Blossom 2015. Wow, so pretty. And this is the corresponding envelope. Yeah, not so similar, but yeah, there's cherry blossom at the back too. So it goes like this. Oh, see the shadow behind. I need to buy the, the beauty light. Most the beauty gurus on YouTube use. So there, are still, there will be no shadow at the back. Next one is this uh, Korean Independence Day card. Korean Independence Day is on August 15th. This one is 2015. August 15, 2015. And this is the corresponding envelope. 
Yeah, there's a butterfly there. There's no butterfly on the card, but yeah. You can see the, I think these are chrysanthemums. You can see the chrysanthemum on the envelope. See? Gorgeous, yeah. I think he didn't, but if you put it against the light, you can see the chrysanthemum pattern. Gorgeous. Independence Day, Kwang Bok Choi, August 15. Yes. The next card is this one. This is Starbucks Coffee Korea 16th anniversary card. You can see specks of silver with glitters at the back surrounding the and this is the gorgeous oh it's like mirroring <laughs> silver envelope yeah and here in front it's so matchy matchy yeah. 16th anniversary same font they use the same font yeah Ooh. 16th anniversary Starbucks Korea open in 2000? 2001. I just check Google. Gotta check Wikipedia. I know Starbucks Philippines opened 1997, and Korea opened later than that, 99 or 2000. So I think this is also a spring card, and this is the corresponding envelope. So pretty. This is the beach. You can see beach umbrellas there, sand. And this is the envelope that goes with it. Matchy, matchy. Yeah. Ooh, also, the front part has some design. The next one is like a typical Starbucks design. I have these car Starbucks cards from different countries. U.S., Philippines, Singapore, and uh, the, the envelope is not very artsy. You see, still nice, better than the plain black one, and it's different. Oh, this envelope is different. Different opening. Yeah. So the next one is I think this is a birthday card with a picture of a cupcake. I don't know. There's a candle here, so I don't know if a candle will stand on top of whipped cream. But this is from 2013. And this is the envelope with balloons. Kopiro Kotkida. Oh, I don't know what it means. And Starbucks and the envelope. Also silver inside. Silver lining inside. Ooh, I got a few more cards to show you. This one is 14th anniversary. Starbucks Korea uh, 14th anniversary card. And this is the corresponding envelope. very simple it's just a house and no pattern on the cover and the outside of the envelope okay maybe i can save time if i put it back later next one is very pretty this is the valentine card i think this from 2012 So gorgeous envelope. Don't you make you? Yeah. Celebrate love. Gorgeous. And here, in front, this front or back. I'll put the envelope later. And second to the last is this uh, 
Year of the Sheep card from 2015. So beautiful. Three sheep. They look like rams, but this is the envelope that comes with it. Pretty, pretty at the back. Some gold patterns. And the last one is my favorite card. It's the Year of the Dragon. So I was born in the Year of the Dragon. And the corresponding card is this one. So in Chinese uh, culture, they give out these red envelopes on New Year's Eve, New Year's Day. And people give money in this red envelope. So it would be nice. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you like and subscribe. And see you on my next Starbucks video. Please mind the gap between the train and the platform. Please mind the gap between the train and the platform. See you later.